Hi everyone, welcome back to the communication module. 6M strategy we'll be discussing today. And this is part of the communication and communication is the most important thing uh, for you to know. It is not about English. It is something that you need to convey. And strategy is one of the very important thing that as a leader you should be implementing and mind you you are a leader no matter which position you are in if in any area of life you are a you are a leader because unless you perform your task other person will not be able to carry forward their task uh, got it so let me share the screen and come to the place where our mind map is. So just give me a few seconds. Yeah. So the moment I... do this... So let me share the screen again. Uh, suppose, so hopefully this time it will be here. Yeah, we are here. So 6M uh, strategy comes under communication where, where in we'll be discussing why we need to master communication uh, to achieve significance. So before that, we already have proven ourselves, our resilience uh, with our, uh, our perseverance, productivity, and efficiency. So now to come to communication, it has a strategy which is about strategic communication. And in that, 6M strategy is one of the area. So let us see what are the uh, 6M strategies are. So the first is magic. We that we can create in the lives of our customers with the products and services that we have and how they create the magical effect on our offer. You know, when we offer something, we, we are thinking about creating magic in their life. They will, from the starting from the ground level. So there we will call that as protagonist level, where he is at a very basic level, just with a mindset that there is a solution possible. That is the um, position he is in. Ultimately, he will go to this level of a game changer. So the first thing is he creates magic in other people's life and in turn, people with their insights and their achievements will create magic in his life. So this is the first magic one should have in mind uh, while in uh, communicating. So your if, if you are a person, as a working professional, you communicate with so many people, your boss, your colleagues, your super boss, your client, and other people. So for each person, how would you create that magic is the first M. The second M is market. Let me hide this so that uh, your Concentration will come here. So the market is, obviously we know the customers whose need we are serving and we are solving a problem. And, uh, and the competition that we have, other, other competitors are also there who are solving the same problem might be. So which niche? what aspect of that need, customer's need that we are serving. That is the second aspect. The third is means. 
the asset and capabilities that we bring to the table. So what tools that we are bringing to the table, how we can minimize the time and effort of the customers and how we can comfortably transform the customer. That is our competency and what our competitors are bringing to the table. See, there are pro and bonds to everything and the customers, it depends on the customer's background, but we need to serve our best. So that is what uh, means is the fourth is money, the way and account of revenue that we are going to get uh, versus the cost and risk that we incur. So recently I have been in uh, touch with a person, a group who are giving some finances to the people who require it. Finances is one thing that which that is not easily available when you need it most. So he is giving that one. So he's creating a creating a very good, very distinctive service in the market. But you know, one has to withstand his kind of behavior. He's kind of a little out of the way. And he is not very, not very, uh, what do you can say, very properly behaved person or very uh, gentle kind of person. So that is a risk and nobody knows whether that person has any authenticity. So far he has not proven to ourselves, but there is a risk factor we need to take, whether we should take that risk or not. Is there enough? Uh, enough support system that we have created not to not to get cheated by such people. That is money is always associated with that. Of course, we need to bless money when we uh, can, we are uh, giving money away, and also we need to bless money when we are receiving it. Obviously, when it comes, we bless, but when it goes, we hardly bless it but that is another kind of strategy which we need to master maybe and that is part of uh, this curriculum as well but uh, you know anyways this is one experience and so many people have so many experiences so uh, as far as money goes not everybody is very very comfortable with uh, dealing with money the fifth thing is things which we consider Im important and also aspire for. So this is the purpose of life. That is what I understand. So what is the meaning if we are doing this and why should we be doing this? So our why should be very clear. So that is the meaning of whatever we are doing. Then the sixth one is momentum, which is about the factors. Those are beyond control, which can help us or hinder us. So whether those are hindering us for the moment, but we will be learning all the way. So here in this particular course, we are not thinking on anything that is uh, hindering us because everything is a lesson learned. But for the time being, for the communication's sake, we should be thinking both ways. It is uh, either way. And it this is the seventh thing, which I think is the mental muscle building, wherein we need to read a lot. Although in uh, communication, we have uh, discussed this reading aspect uh, to at length. But here, what we can do is, we can um, form one hour, some one hour strategy. We can read this book by Jeroen Kreisen Brink. And uh, he talks about this 6M strategy at length. So we need to read everything and master this according to us, according to our circumstances. And then we can get it validated with other people with market. 
so that is all about 6m strategy hope you enjoyed this thing and this is it this is all that we have today about 6m strategy we'll see we see you in the next video <laughs> thank you